It's a new year and new travel to look forward to, and one of the places I'm going to this year is Athens, Greece. One of the reasons why I'm going to Athens, Greece is for the second annual World FUE FUE Workshop. Just a few short months ago that I was attending the first annual World FUE Institute workshop, and that was in Tenerife, Spain. It was a fantastic success. A lot of people showed up, and there was some great surgery being performed, lots of great presentations. And the great thing about this is that some of the world's greatest names in FUE hair restoration are sharing their knowledge to help you be better with your FUE surgery as well. And during the workshop in Tenerife, I was able to get most of the founding members of WFI together in a room, sit down and talk about what WFI is really about, what the goals are, and what visiting doctors can learn uh, and maybe take home back to their own practice. So check it out. I am with the World FUE Institute founding members um, after the very first FUE workshop that they presented. <laughs> You're not gonna make this easy, are you? <laughs> Take 23. <laughs> Uh, we're here in Tenerife, Spain um, with the founding members of World FUE Institute after the very first FUE workshop. Um, it's been a pretty intensive day of presentations and surgeries and um, we have Ron Shapiro, we have Jose Lorenzo, Bijan Ferraduni, Dr. Chueco, we got Dr. Tony Rustin, Dr. Emre Lupanzula. Yes, there are, there are a few people missing. We also have uh, Dr. Karai Erdogan. Uh, Dr. Jerry Wong, who couldn't make it, uh, and Hussein uh, Rahal. Yeah, Alex we got Dr. Rahal. Alex Alex Ginsburg. Ginsburg. Alex Ginsburg. And Alex Ginsburg, yes. Um, yeah, from, the from uh, Tel Aviv. I wanted to talk to you more about what WFI is, or the World FU Institute, because um, a lot of people don't know yet. L let's start with this. What is the purpose of WFI? The FUE? Yes. Of course. The technique of the FUE, uh, that uh, uh, we want to focus on that and develop it and uh, research and uh, also show. FUE is relatively new compared to yeah. other techniques and it's rapidly been changing. Mm -hmm. And I guess there's been sort of a lag of being able to go and get the latest, most up to date information. The idea was to try to uh, bring together some of the people that are doing the more innovative, the newest, and, and question things and try to advance the field. Try to, and, and, and you can see that this, at this, at this um, workshop alone, there are so many new things. Uh, coverage value uh, yeah. uh, is, is going to be a huge, a huge thing. So th there's a lot of new, uh, there's new techniques in, in, um, in FUE, uh, like the Trivellini punch, the Wah punch, uh, the, the differences between uh, maybe the ability to do advanced alopecia that, um, that people have a lot of questionable things that people want to know that, that were addressed yeah. and you know the answers aren't all there but you have to have a place where you know this can be done. Yeah, we have a need to learn and the, and the uh, best thing is to learn to the other colleagues that do the same and we have questions and we have to answer that question mm -hmm. and this is a group to to search the, the answers of that we need to improve we need to improve our practice you know so it's better to be together than alone in our in our side so by sharing our experience we're all improving our, the way that we're doing our issue lab this is the, the main goal of this. And then on the other hand, as Ron said, is to educate also the, the beginners here and the new strategies that we have to treat mm -hmm. the FUE and the new, all the tools that we have uh, around, like the new apps that we have and all that kind of things. I mean, that uh, we have to, to take all the new things and put it together and think together, but focus all the time on FUE. Right. And uh, not also FUE, I mean, we talk also about uh, other things. Uh, I like very much the debate that we have about UPA, I mean, the transition mm -hmm. of the gonorrhea, complications, uh, depletion of the gonorrhea, all that kind of thing that uh, uh, sometimes we uh, 
our lack to see those things in other meetings. I mean, sometimes we are repeating the same things in all the meetings, and it's also the same. But we want to, uh, we are sorry, and um, we teach, but we want to learn also. The main thing is that uh, that way we can advance in our uh, our learning of the technique. Right, right. I mean that uh, this uh, year we have done a very big jump in yes. all the things because there are there were lots of things that we uh, uh, saw here in this meeting that were totally new. Mm -hmm. I've never heard about that in the, in, in the previous meeting. Yeah. Let, me, let me ask you this. This is something that, that you're all dealing with, and it's the proliferation of FUE clinics everywhere, every week, opening up. Yep. Do you feel like what you're doing is helping to maybe address this by setting these standards that yeah. clinics could, could never possibly really live up to because they're taking too many shortcuts and they're just trying to make a fast buck. In other words, do you think that this is a way to, to differentiate yourselves from these fly-by-night clinics, these rogue clinics? There's no bad technique, mm -hmm. just bad doctors. The thing is, we gonna we, we won't say that we are the bad. We, we are saying we are good. There are other good people. We want them. So by, by offering your knowledge to share with everyone, I think that you are elevating the standards and helping I'm not talking about separating you guys I'm talking about separating clinics that want to actually do good and learn the best techniques apart from those that are just trying to make a quick buck and and as a side effect it's not the goal of the society but as a side effect if you can establish a place where you can really share the knowledge and, and really discover what's the truth yeah. about what should and shouldn't be done then hopefully that'll rub off everywhere. So that was just a taste of what was being shared and discussed at the first annual workshop in Tenerife, Spain. That was November 2016. The second annual WFI workshop will be in Athens, Greece, June 22nd, 23rd, and 24th. I'm going to be there. I'm going to be presenting as well as a couple new faculty members uh, talking about holding solutions and um, additional new FUE techniques. Reschedule your surgeries, cancel your consultations, clear off your schedule, and don't forget to be in Athens. Links are down below, wfiworkshop.com. You can register, you can see the entire program. See you there. Mm -hmm.